But there's a massive brown stain. Uh, there. Okay. Really Too much info. TMI, TMI, like TMI. Tell them to eat something spicy. Everything will go down smoothly on the other end. Okay. Why? Why can't I use half times base times height on these ones? Yeah. If you do it, he's already said the answer. Oh. Okay. It's so hot. I had football changing this morning. Yeah. Sorry to hear that. Yeah. Really, really sorry to hear that. So everything is the same. Nothing very difficult. Putting in a formula, doing a bit of algebra, using quad formula, completing the square, and solving it. Any questions? What? You said in the thing in the group chat that you want me to cut my hair. Yeah. Oh, just give me a pair of scissors and I'll cut it. Just get a shaver and then just shave it all off. Okay, everyone got it. So we've got two examples for area of triangle, but this is not going to be your right angle triangle, yeah? So just be careful. You're not going to be using half A, B sign. Oh, sure, I said the formula. Damn it. Um, I was going to say, don't use half times base times height. Why? Why can't I use half times base times height on these ones? Because, yeah, if you do it... He's already said the answer. Oh. Okay. So it's not a right angle triangle, right? So if people remember... The area of a triangle that is non-right angle triangle is half AB sine C, right? All it means is if I was to just use a triangle to show what this means, this is going to be your A, this is going to be your B, and this is going to be your C, capital C. So sine the angle, that's all. So if I look at this triangle on the top, I'm going to say A equals half times my A, in this case is what? 3x minus 1 times my b, what is my b? x plus 2. Make sense? Yes or no? Yeah? I'm just using a and b here. Look, 3x minus 1 is my a, x plus 2 is my b. Times sine, well, what would be my sine c in this case? Sine what? 30. Just follow the angle, isn't it? So then you have a equals half. If you expand this bracket, 3x minus 1 and x plus 2, 3x times x, 3x squared, 3x times 2, 6x, 6x minus x, 5x, minus two, what's sine 30? Half, so you have a equals half times half is what? One over four, bracket, three x squared, plus five x, minus two. Now, what is the area? 60 is given, isn't it? So I can say 60 equals one over four, bracket, three x squared, plus five x, minus two. What can I do? Okay, go on. Times about four. Yeah, cross multiply the fraction here, four, by 60, right? So that's what, 240, 3x squared, plus 5x minus two, and then move the 240 to the right-hand side, so you get a quadratic, plus 5x minus two, minus 240, equals zero. So then we're left with 3x squared, plus 5x, minus 242, equals zero. Yeah, that's the quadratic. Now we need to solve this quadratic, so I'll just do this here on this section. So I'll rewrite the quadratic here. 3x squared plus 5x minus 242 equals 0. You can use completing the square or quadratic formula as your choice. We'll stick with quad formula here. So x equals minus b plus and minus square root b squared minus 4ac over 2a. Yeah. What would be my a, b, c? Well, your a is the number that's in front of x squared. In this case, it's 3. Your b is going to be the number in front of x, which is 5. And your C is going to be what? Very good. Excellent. 242. Excellent. Minus. Minus 242. Yeah. And then you just that. <laughs> I was going to say. Speaking like you. I was going to say you dash it back in the form. You put it back in the formula. You don't dash it in the formula. You substitute it back. So minus B is what? Minus 5. Plus and minus square root B squared, which is what? 5 squared. Minus 4 times 3 times c, which is minus, and then obviously you could just put this in the calculator, yeah, 2a, which is 6. Anyone did this? Who put it in the, yeah, go on. Uh, minus 9.85 Minus what, 9.85? Yeah. yeah. And the other one is? 8.1. 8.1, yeah. Obviously, just put that in the calculator and you get the answer. You can use completing the square. It is absolutely your choice. Whatever you want to do, do. And that's it for the first example. Any questions? Is this a bit of algebra or is it big B? Anyone scared of a fly, I guess? Just be careful. So why is there a plug socket in the ceiling? Why is there what? Plug socket in the ceiling. Where? Like behind you. Oh, that's because once we've utilized all the plug socket here, we need more. So we just go at to the top. There's one behind you as well. I know. It's easier to put on the top, you know. 
so people don't trip over, I guess. Okay, right, everyone got it? All right, we'll go for the second example as well. All you're doing, again, it's just algebra, you're just putting it inside the formula, that is it. Is it cold here or is it, okay? It's cold. Is it cold? Krish, do you know is it cold? You feel, you okay? Hello? See, I wasn't making it up. No, I know you weren't making it up, but majority of people were against you, so. Right, so, second example. I guess when you guys go back outside, you're gonna get that whoosh of. Is it hot or is it cold outside? It's so hot. Well, I had football training this morning, yeah. Yeah. Like, literally, two minutes away from me. And, like, it was so long. We had to do match drills, sprints, everything. Sounds like breaking news to us. No, and yesterday we had PE, yeah, and I had to do the world up yesterday. Sorry to hear that. No. Really, really sorry to hear that. And then we had to play more football matches. No one cares. Look okay, here, let's just get on now. So, so, so okay, so again, what you want to do, second example, right? Always write the formula. Area equals half AB sine C. We know the area is given 50 half times A, which is in this, in the, okay, when I, it doesn't matter which one you choose A and B because you're going to multiply them out anyway, yeah? So 4x plus 1, x minus 3, times sine C, which is sine 30. So again, 50 equals half, expand the bracket, 4x squared minus 12, uh, minus 12 minus 11x minus 3, sine 30 is half, half times half is a quarter, and then bracket 4x squared minus 11x minus 3. Get rid of the 4, so times that by 50, cross multiply it, so that's 200 equals to 4x squared minus 11x minus 3. So if I just rewrite that here, so we have 4x squared minus 11x, move the 200 to the right hand side, so it becomes minus 200, so 4x squared minus 11x minus 203 equals 0. And then again, use a quadratic formula to solve it, yeah? So once you use a quadratic, well, anyone? Oh, yeah, what do you get for the answer when you use that? 8.63 minus 5.88. Yeah. Minus 5.88, yeah? Yeah. Okay. So that's the two values that you should get when you use the quadratic formula. So everything is the same. Nothing very difficult. Putting in a formula, doing a bit of algebra, using quad formula, completing the square and solving it for now. And then we'll introduce some features, some costs, and can't do tan in these ones. Any questions? That are you a barber? What? Are you a barber? Am I a barber? Yeah. See, I don't know what that means. Are you saying baba? Or are you saying barber? Barber. Uh, yeah, I was. The one that cuts your hair. Yeah, yeah. Why? Yeah, she said she wants like, you to like, make me bald. She what? What? You said in the thing in the group chat that you want me to cut my hair. Yeah. Who cut whose hair? Oh, just give me a pair of scissors and I'll cut it. Just get a shaver and then just shave it all off. Okay, everyone got it? Yes? Right, so let's start with these questions. This whole week has been... How, how was school? It must have been difficult, is it? Did you guys have aircon or anything in school? No. You guys sleep with your fans on? Yeah. Just a little hint or tip. If you, maybe you guys know this. So you put the, get a towel, put cold water, rinse it, and then put that over the fan. Yeah, what well, if you put a hot towel on? Does it turn into like a heater? Wow, that's amazing. How did you figure that out? Actually... You deserve a Nobel Prize for this. That's amazing. Never thought about that. I'm going to use that in winter. Okay, so try and do these questions. Just follow the example step by step. Do not write anything I did not write. Don't know why people write some random alien things that I did not even put on the board. So is that 2x or 7x? What would you like it to be? 2. 2 then, 2 it is. These are kind of like typical exam questions as well that comes up, yeah? So if you understand the principles behind it, the method, it's pretty straightforward. Nothing too much to think about. Okay, cool. Write a bit neater. Neater, neater. That's much better. You've changed. Why are you writing like this? I don't. Why, what's the gap here between this fraction and that fraction? Bring it together. In the exam, you're not going to have that much space. Anyone got 0 0.5 as a first answer? No. What was one of your answers? 7.53. Yeah. What was the quadratic? Um, 2x squared minus x minus 121. Yeah. Okay. Uh, first one, 7.53 minus 8.03. Minus 8 yeah. You were the first one here, what? No, it's good. Man, I've, I've whoa, whoa, hold up. How did 120 become 240? Okay, do you know how to do the quad formula? If you don't copy everything on the example, 
It's very difficult for you now to follow this. Okay, so that's your quadratic, right? This is the quadratic formula. So you're gonna have two answers here. One of them, you're gonna have minus one plus square root nine, six, nine over four. Yeah, you know how to put that in the calculator. And then minus one minus square root nine, six, nine over four. And those are your two answers. You've got to make sure, I wrote this. So you've got to make sure you copy what I write in the example. Or else you're going to, when you do the questions, you're going to struggle. What would you get for second one? If we said you were a changed man. Um, I've got minus 3.36 and 3.94. Oh, yeah. I've got same But you just said you guys got different. Yeah, but hers is not, not correct. Hers is a few decimal places away. Wait, what was it? It's minus 3.36. Yeah. And 3.94. Yeah, the method does not change it stays the same yeah stick them stick to the method if you stick to the method you don't have to worry and then everything else is just a bit of algebra that you're expanding and simplifying and then putting in the calculator that's all it is you start writing something completely different then i can't help you what is it krish what are you asking whispering to him for three so what would you get for three you got that you didn't get that. You didn't get that, Krish. Okay, check the quadratic. Check your quadratic. What was it? Okay, that means your quadratic formula then. You got the quadratic, right? Did you do three? Excellent. So you just skip three and you go to four. And we're doing a maths lesson as well. Very good. Are you dreaming, Aaron? Are you dreaming? Because you're smiling at yourself. It looks a bit weird. Why are you smiling? You were smiling when I looked at you. Maybe you're enjoying the work, is it? No. Who's your bike? You parked it. Did you take your seat with it or yes. it'll get stolen again? In the A level class, there's a student, he takes his uh, seat with him. People will think you're actually you're stealing the bike. Yeah. <laughs> people will, will be, when you're doing that, people will think you're stealing the bike. <laughs> what was two, Amari? You said you had it right. Yeah, it's uh, minus 3.36 and 3.36. 3 times minus 1 is minus 3x, fine. Minus 1 times 4x is what? Minus 4x. What's minus 4x minus 3x? Oh, my mm. Finished? Yeah. Finished, Anna? What'd you guys get for 6 and 7 then? 4.06 minus 8.31. 7, I got 8 and minus 11. Quadratic? Which one? Uh, 6 because you, she's definitely got different to you. 4x, 5, 17x, minus 5. Minus 5. 35? Yeah. Pretty sure she knows where she went wrong. What about the next quadratic? 2x squared plus 7x minus 2x Yeah. Uh, she... <laughs> okay. I'm going to... Well, wait, the answer. She, yeah. You have done it. No, no, tell him. What's the answer? Poor guy. He's a changed man. Check the quadratic. What was your quadratic? Uh, 12x squared minus 8x minus 104. Is that different, is it? For 3? Yeah. For 3? What? Where's your working out? What, what is this? That's not three. I did it there. Where's your, no, 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 where's your actual working out, Amari? Show me the working out. You'll get, you'll, you'll get the answer wrong if you don't put the working out. Show me the working out. You're on five, Krish. Yeah. Well, he's overtaking you now. So minus four times A, sorry, times that. So put that in the calculator, four times 12 times minus 159. Which one are you on? Uh, what about two? Take your time. I'll just go get a picnic. You see, if you just stick to the method, it's very easy. These are like four or five marks uh, questions. I've seen it come up in the exam. Very easy. Yeah. Chris, stop looking at Aaron. It's very creepy the way you're looking at him. Do I need to get bodyguards here? Huh? 30 over y. Then Correct. You, know what y is. you need to find that. But how do you find that? That's for you to think about. Oh. Mark, right, phone off. Yes, I was trying to find that picture of you that you posted of you on the mountain. Oh, yeah. That was photoshopped. No, it wasn't. It was Photoshop Mountain. So you had fake success. Yes, fake success. Okay, I'm gonna comment now. No, 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 no. It's real. It's real. It's real. It's definitely real. It was in uh, Lake District. We went. It was. Uh, That's in like. Sniss. Yeah, it's about five hours from here. Wow. Well, yeah. yeah. It's a bit near Scotland, but it's um, Kendal. So the 932 meters we went up the mountain. You fall. You die. Did you die? Oh. Well, clearly not, because I'm here. Uh, there we go, sir. <laughs> How the heck did you zoom in right up there? I can zoom in more. Okay, you don't need to zoom in so much more. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, you don't need to see my face. There we go. Yeah, that, that, thanks. I appreciate it. It was a very good trip. Seven hours trek to get there. 
No, we saw someone falling and then they went back down because it was too dangerous. So they were falling? They what, fell. What, what, what was the point of walking seven kilometers? Seven hours. Seven Dry, hours. Seven yeah, hours. seven so hours. What's the point of that? You get to the top, it's a mountain. You could have done other things in that. Right? No, but that's the whole point. You go there so for. Or helicopter. I guess you guys don't understand what it is to actually go and climb a mountain, but. No, because I never climbed a mountain. You never climbed a mountain. Your mountain is what your set of stairs at home, is it? To go to your room. Okay. Try it, it's good. It's a good experience when you guys. Like, you. I've seen kids younger than you walking as well. They're up there, and I'm like, bloody hell, what the heck? <laughs> it's they embarrassing for they me. They didn't choose to do that. Oh, no, they, they were well trained. Their parents trained them from young age. Why? You kid, so it's a thing, it's a lifestyle there. It's a very lifestyle. Yes. Um, yeah, sure is it? He gave me a bewildered look, surprised look. What? They're trained. Yeah, I'm like this, walking like this, holding everything, because it's rocks. There's no grass, it's all rocks. One little trip, and that's it, you fall. These kids are just literally like... Their parents just start forcing them to climb up. No, their parents started them from very young. We went up three hours, uh, four hours, went down so three hours. Extra. You walked in like five minutes, but you walked like... That's the whole point. The whole point is to, you know you've done it. That's the whole point of doing a mountain. He said, he said in, in this side, you look like the teachers in assembly. It's my serious look. You look a bit worried in that picture. No, no, no. I'm just always serious. I have a serious face. Uh, what would you get for 8? Peter got 87.2 and Y got 8.19 Nice What would you get for 9, Peter and Y? Uh, y got 17.1, Peter 48.7 What's that circle that I'm going to The circle of life Have you found, have you done the, have you found X first? Okay, so you haven't even done that and you're asking how to find it First find X It's easy now, right? Yeah This is what I'm saying, if you stick to the method, it's not that hard Right? Straight to the point, that's it Different I'm writing different questions, don't you worry. There's a massive brown stain. Yeah, on the okay. <laughs> Too much info. TMI, TMI, like TMI. Okay, that's fine. Thank you. Let's get on with it now. Come on, tell them to eat something spicy. Everything will go down smoothly on the other end. Okay, right. So what happens if you fail? Then you just be a business fan, don't you? Well, are you selling prime bottles and ripping them other people off? Has everyone done four, uh, three, four, five? I can rub this off, yeah? Sir? Yeah. Question two. Yes. Could you just do a normal Pythagoras? Correct. It's a right angle triangle, so it's Pythagoras. There's no other way.